What is going on guys? Before this video plays, I just want to let you guys know really quick that I actually have merch now. I actually have a merch store and uh, you can check it out. The link will be in the description. I'll also put it on the bottom of the screen. Uh, but the designs are 100% made by me and they look really nice on you know t-shirts and you know all, all the stuff that I have on there. So please go ahead and take a second to take a look at that merch store. I'll also leave a coupon code down below just in case you guys do actually want to get something. Uh, it'll take off like 10% off of the uh, the total purchase, so go ahead and use that, and let's get into the video. Thanks, guys. What is going on, guys? It is your fellow Tenno Defton here, and I am back bringing you another video. I've recorded this for like the fourth time, and I'm very, very sad. But I fixed it now, I think. I think I fixed my recording software, so we should be good to go. Hopefully, it does record more than a minute because that's what was going on before not even a minute it was it was like a second it recorded it for one second and then it was like no no else what no no else what the fuck does that even mean anyway so today as you can tell we are going to be doing another episode of beginner's luck if you guys are new to the series what I do here is I go over a bunch of different aspects of the game Warframe and uh, I Go through a bunch of different aspects whether it is for veterans or for new players and today it is going to be a subject for the newer players it is going to be about forma and this is actually brought to me by this guy so thank you so much and i will do your other uh your other suggestion sometime later this week i also want to do a video on on the relic system later on this week so i'll try and get all three of those videos out this week cross my fingers I hope that I can get them out in time um, editing is really the only thing that's holding me back anyway so let's get right into this thing so first off what exactly is forma if you do not know what forma is I'm very confused on why you're on this video but just in case forma is a resource that is used to actually uh, rank your warframe down um, meaning rank it down to rank zero but on top of that you are actually able to put a, a new polarity on one of the slots here i've already formed my chroma because as i said i did this video earlier so yeah i'm gonna have to switch my warframe i will switch to ash because i never use ash um anymore but let's say here i have ash right so in order to form the warframe he has to first of all he or she or weapons, I should say, because it's both weapons and warframes. Uh, they or it or whatever has to actually be rank 30. Once it is rank 30, that is the time that you are actually able to forma. Now, the benefits of forma is you are able to switch one of the slots to the polarity of whatever mod you want to put on there. The best option to you, or the best like I guess method to go, uh, to go with or go for or, you know, like use is really to try and take the mod with the largest amount of slots or the largest amount of capacity if that makes sense so the mod that that takes the most capacity that's the one that you should probably try and put a uh put a forma onto or put a forma onto the slot that it's on so in my case it would be redirection right like let's say uh I do have another redirection if I type it in here redirection this should fit and it gets it to zero let's say I wanted to get this up one more I can't or let's say I wanted to get transient fortitude up a couple more I can't because there's no more capacity right but what forma does it is it allows for more capacity to be given by taking away the the capacity reduction of mods so in this case uh for redirection it splits the capacity reduction it splits it by half and it goes by uh, it rounds up if that makes sense so in this case it's 13 usually half of 12 that's six right but it's actually going to reduce it to seven because of that's just the way that the system works it's just that that's just the way that the system works so it rounds up to 
like the the closest number that it could be split in half by so that's the way that this thing works uh we have like, i think transient fortitude in my case i believe that is a mod that also has 13 yes it does so as you could tell what i was saying before was true so if we split it in half you see that transient fortitude is actually is it's actually supposed to take up 13 slots well in this case it actually takes up seven as you can tell here it takes up seven instead the reason being is that whole roundup system that i was telling you about so that's all well and fine defton okay i understand what forma is now um and if you don't please feel free to leave a comment oh my god that's assist i need to get that off um please feel free to leave a comment and let me know you know if i am not very clear on certain things i will definitely clear it up or somebody in the comments in general will clear it up for me but i'm gonna move along and we're gonna go into how to get in general forma so getting forma is rather simple it is a very easy process all you have to do is go over here and voila relics that is exactly how you get forma if you don't know what relics are i will hopefully be posting a video on relics as i said earlier later on in the week so look out for that video but relics are basically a system for obtaining prime parts and forma so that that's basically it you obtain forma from a bunch of different relics as you can tell this one has forma in it uh this one has forma in it this one has forma in it like a bunch of different relics have forma not every single one because as you can tell this one doesn't have any forma but this one does like it varies it depends on the relic now you can find a sheet that actually tells you which relics actually drop forma but chances are the relic that you get is going to have forma in it regardless as a reward uh so you don't really need to use it for farming for the relics uh if you're if forma is what you're going for but i, I mean that, that's basically it yeah you, you just don't need it <laughs> you don't need it you don't need a sheet in order to do it uh or in order to uh farm for it so how exactly do i build forma well it's easy you get the blueprint from the relics and it, it comes out as a reward just like anything else any other prime part and then you go to miscellaneous and it'll be under this menu it'll be right underneath for me it's the distilling extractor uh, right before the genetic code template but the requirements to build forma are very simple all you need is one neurode one neural sensor one morphix and one orican cell and on top of that you just need 35,000 credits uh, and that is for each build of them so it's something like an orcan catalyst where you know where, where you just place it on your warframe and then uh, that's it that's that's all you have to do in that menu that i showed you before another thing that i do want to point out is uh it's definitely something that i was afraid of when i first formed uh because i wasn't very informed because back then there wasn't much really to go off of but orcan reactors and orcan catalysts those actually stay on the weapon or warframe or whatever after you forma so you don't have to worry about after forming you you have to somehow get another catalyst or reactor no 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 it stays there and you're good to go you don't have to worry about it anymore so that's one thing to keep in mind when it comes to this uh you don't really have to worry about uh you know about your orcan catalyst or reactors in any way shape or form so that is really it actually that's really all there is to forma that's all there is to the forma system um as i said the best strategy for actually using forma or for polarizing a slot which is basically what you're doing um really the best strategy for it is to just try and place it on the mods or the slots where the mods are planned to go if that makes sense uh that have the highest capacity so whichever mods have the highest capacity out of all of the other mods those are the ones that you would probably want to form a first or you would want to get that slot form at first so that's it that's it to the video it's a really simple system i hope you guys did enjoy 
If you do have any questions, please go ahead and leave them in the comments. I will gladly answer them. And as I said, if I don't, somebody else in the comments will. If you did like my content and you have not already, please go ahead and subscribe. I try and post as much as I can, but I am in college, so I, I do have to keep up with work with that. Not only that, but I also am working on a video game, a bunch of different stuff. So leave a like if you did enjoy, and I'll catch you guys in the next video and or stream. Thanks a lot, guys. Peace.